have to get to the truth of what happened that night. I am for truth, no matter who tells it. I'm for justice, no matter who it's for or against. Eighteen years, ten months, twenty-four days. That's how long Warren Cave has sat in prison for the murder of Chuck Berman. I helped seal Warren's fate with a series of articles. But is there an innocent man in prison? And did I lead that charge? get to the truth of what happened that night. The people will get their show. How are you guys doing? Great, great. Really good. It's Man Crush Monday for me, for real, right now. Oh, OK. Well, let's go. <laughs> all right, all right. right back at you. <laughs> <laughs> so um, obviously, both of you play against Poppy, per the Poppy Purnell character. One is the ex, and one is the husband. Um, can you talk a little bit about that dynamic and will we ever see you two face off before the series is over? Well, I mean, it's an interesting dynamic and journey that we're going on. And especially if we go for a couple of seasons, you're going to see that dynamic even right. be more interactive. Right. Um, I know in our first episode, we have a couple of quick words. <laughs> right. A um, little tension that just lets you know, here we go on this journey. Um, but I think that, you know, our history, as far as our characters are concerned, are very different with, with uh, when it comes to Poppy. And I think that we're just trying to navigate the waters that she's creating this this storm, this on, the, storm. On, the, right. on the ocean. Yeah. And everybody's trying to figure out, what the devil are you doing, Poppy? <laughs> right. You know, and uh, so it creates a... And then his his dynamic is, is totally different than mine because obviously he's married right. you know, to her. Definitely. Yo, I think, you know, the... the the way we intersect is by what she's doing and how right. it's, I think for me, it's driving her away from my character and in my character's head closer to Makai's character. Right. And right. that is something that uh, upsets him, right. to say the <laughs> least. Right, right, right. And the tactics that she's using in this realm as far as trying to get the truth. Right. You know, with this podcast, there's certain things that she's doing that's irresponsible right. as Definitely. a journalist. Yes. You know? Yes. So bad. I'm sorry. Oh, yeah, for sure. Now, I, correct me if I'm wrong, but in Marcus's phone, Poppy's not, her name's not there, right? It says Trouble. Trouble, right, right. yes. Have you ever had, had a situation like that? You had to rename someone in your phone? <laughs> I've renamed a lot of people. No, um, <clears throat> not, uh, not, not like that, but, um, you know, it just kind of shows, there's a play in our dynamic you know um, sometimes you know like they say um, people can gravitate towards trouble mm -hmm. and you know gravitate towards seeing the train wreck and can't look away so I think it's a play on his dynamic with her rather than a, it's not a disrespectful gesture obviously it's his phone nobody's gonna but you know it's you know it's just his way of dealing with her and you know and got you I got you and Michael, your character, um, your your background and Poppy's background, I'm, I'm sorry, Ingram's background and Poppy's right. background, they're very vastly different. Can right. you talk about the, that dynamic a little bit? Well, Ingram grew up in a very wealthy home uh, with uh, loving parents uh, who are, you know, what we would call bougie. Right. And, <laughs> you know, the right. and so he's had the finest education and, you know, and Poppy, has not. Poppy's father was a Black Panther and he's yeah. now the, right. the head of a biker gang and yeah. uh, you know they grew up hard and so right. when when and the idea of Ingram's family would not want him it's with weird. a Poppy. Yeah. Right? He needs to be someone more refined, someone who's gone to Harvard or Yale right. or you know so that already is a right. is a deep um contention between the families. Got you. They're wrapping me up. I wish I had more time with you guys, but thank you so much. Thank you. Congratulations.